Yo, what's going on guys? We're talking WWE WrestleMania 33 happened last night. We're gonna be talking about two of my favorite moments of WWE WrestleMania last night. That was the return of the Hardy Boys and the Undertaker's match. Now, as you guys know, the Hardy Boys, it was an unexpected surprise. They were supposed to have a triple threat tag team match, ladder match, and the New Day came out, and quite honestly, I was assuming the New Day was going to come out to make this tag team match a little bit better. I, For whatever reason, I didn't put the dots together, connect them, whatever. You guys might have. But when I seen this ladder match, I was like, there, there's nobody on this match that can do a ladder match. <laughs> they was all big guys. And that's when the New Day came out. I was like, oh, well, the New Day will make it better. You know, Kofi Kingston's good on the ladders. And then they came out and surprised us with the Hardy Boys. And man, I was ecstatic. There's nobody I wanted to see come back more than the Hardy Boys. It's been rumored for years now. So, so you know, it's one of those things you don't really you don't think twice about because it's been rumored so many different times and they actually made their returns in the grandest stage of them all and being the hardy boys doing what they do twist the fade off the top of the ladder swanton bomb off the top of the ladder for jeff hardy that's just how it goes and they end up winning the tag team titles honestly the best match of the night i think but the saddest match of the night, if you want to call it that, Undertaker versus Roman Reigns. It had that feeling, that especially, you know, going into WrestleMania, talking about Undertaker possibly hanging up the boots. And then they make the match, the final match of the show. And then you know something is up. Needless to say, Undertaker, Roman Reigns put on a great fight. Undertaker got speared through a table. There were tombstones, there were chairs, there were spears, multiple spears. And Roman Reigns ended the match with a spear bouncing off the ropes a couple times, speared the Undertaker, pinned him, and ended the match. And it wasn't so much the match as what happened after it. Undertaker, clearly, the most emotional you could say you've seen him in a WWE ring ever, was trying to keep it together out there, but you could tell just by the way he's acting. By the way Roman Reigns acted after the match, like, this was it. Undertaker was going to be retiring after this WrestleMania. And moments later, you see Undertaker yanks, takes off his gloves, takes off his jacket, walks up the ramp in pretty much a symbolization that he is done with WWE. It has been a long 27-year career for Undertaker. You can't look past that fantastic career. He's going to be missed. As for this video, though, guys, like I said, definitely a WrestleMania that won me over. I was a little skeptical going into it, but it definitely had, it made it better. They did a great job this year. I hope you guys enjoyed WrestleMania. I did too. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.